Welcome to part five of the use of Microsoft Excel in the building of wireframes and screen flow diagrams. Here I'm going to talk about linked icon files. That is the linking of icons in an icon library to the placeholders in a wireframe. So as you update those in the library, those in the wireframes will automatically follow suit. Going to sheet four, you will see I already have imported some icons. It is important that the cell size is set to the same size as the imported icon. And to set the cell size, you remember we did this in part one for our grid, we go to the toolbar and select Format, Column and Width. And Format, Row and Height. Set the sizes in the dialog box. Select the cell into which you want to place the icon, and then in the menu bar, go to Insert, Photo, and Picture from File, and choose the appropriate icon. To create our linked icons, we need a new tool, one that does not automatically appear in the toolbar. It's called the camera tool. Get that by going to the menu bar and select view, toolbars and custom toolbars and menu. Ensure the comments tab is selected in the customized menu and all commands in the categories list. And in the commands list type C or navigate the list until you reach the camera. Select the camera and with the shift key down drag the camera icon to the toolbar, let go and select OK. You are now the proud possessor of the camera icon tool. You see in my icon library I have a column marked current and this is where I shall place the active icon. Select the icon by navigating to it using the navigation key on the keyboard. Once the cell is selected click on the camera tool. You will then see a moving dotted line around the cell. Also see the cursor has changed to a pair of crosshairs or a square in the current application cell. The icon has been copied to the cell with its own black square border. Now copy and paste that shape into the wireframe sheet. Now go to the formula bar, the one marked FX, remove whatever is in there and enter the equal sign. Go to the icon library and select the active icon. The wireframe, you will see the bank icon is now in the square. Resize the icon. You can copy and paste this icon, placing them in the appropriate screens. Remembering to place one in our little parts library on this sheet. Should now group the icons to their appropriate screens. To show that they are indeed linked, we return to the icon library sheet. Delete the icon from the active cell and replace it with another icon and return to the wireframe. Remember how the text is linked? We can also change the name to suit.
and our wireframe is totally up to date.